it's the Ruby Weapon Hour with our very special guest, Steve Buscemi. <laughs> It's time to play the intro, it's time to chug mustard, it's time to meet the gingers on Peach's stream tonight. It's time to pet the baby, it's time to shake the bag, it's time to order McDonald's on Peach's stream tonight. Why do you guys come here? I guess I'll never know. It's like a kind of torture to manage this shit show. Shadow Cuzzle. And now let's get things started. Why don't you get it started? It's time to read donations on the most sensational, incompetable, unbeatable, blind debatable. This is what we call the Ruby Weapon Stream. What? Why would you do that? Hello today. Hello today. Hello on this day. What? What? Test, test, one, two, one, two, wah, wah, wah. Can you see and or hear me as well as the music? Wah, 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 wah. Excellent, wah, and wah to you, wah to you. Hello today and welcome to the Ruby Weapon Hour. I am Peach, how's it going? Uh, so I am in my VTuber form as you can see. I was going to try to uh, get my webcam working, but for some reason, uh, it was like, no, so here I am. But that's fine. This works just as well. Um, today, as you can see, we will be playing Sands of Aura, hashtag sponsored. Thank you so much, guys. Um, oh, yeah, did you guys hear about Haunted Chocolatier? Did you guys hear about that? That's by the um, Stardew Valley people, right? That's super cool. Yeah, definitely uh, check that out as well. Um, so I will give the most, oh yeah, oh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, look it up, look it up. Uh, so we will give the briefest of thanks, a very brief thank a Rooney, and uh, then we will start the game. And I wanna make sure uh, that I really show you guys what this game is all about, so I probably won't read uh, the rest of the donations until the end. And then we will raid Pat because uh, he will also be playing Sands of Aura, but not nearly as incredibly good and smart as I will be playing it, but he will do his best. Did I play this before streaming? So, yes, I gave this a nice hearty gander and I, so, okay, I wanna be very real with you guys. I don't take sponsorships often. And the reason for that is not because I don't get offers. I get, my email is filled with them quite a lot. Um, but I took a look at this and I like the idea. So, so what it says is that it's like, it's supposed to have like a kind of a marriage between Wind Waker, Diablo, and Dark Souls. And so immediately my ears were like peaked. I was like, ooh, ooh, I, there is nothing about that that I don't like. So, um, it, right, right, it's a lot of games, a lot of games. So I'm cur I was curious to see, and I gave it a gander, and so far, genuinely, and again, I, I, don't, I won't take a sponsorship that um, I don't really feel like uh, I can be honest about. But, so this, this one, I can be honest, I genuinely really like it so far. Um, I like how the swings are kind of weighty. You'll see what I mean, you'll see what I mean. Um, because sometimes how, you know how when you like swish a sword and you don't like feel it? Kind of like how Pat like talks about this with Dark Souls too, how like you swing and you move and there's no weight. There's like, there's weight here, um, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, oh, I, did I not explain what I meant? I'm sorry, swinging my sword, excuse me. Um, Let's see. Oh, and if you want to check out the trailer or anything like that, please feel free to check out my code, which is in the title, which is free.tm slash peach to give it a gander if you're interested. 
Good to see you, Shark. Shark Missile. I almost called you Shark Missile. Oops. So I'm going to give a very, very brief thank Aruni because you guys are so kind, and then we'll get started, okay? Sleepy Coffee resubbed for 36 months. It has been three years in the Pat Dungeon. The light is blinding. I know, right? Tiz86 resubbed. Tier 2 for 56 months. Thank you so much, Tiz. And Tiz also gifted a sub to Janene. Vintage Spiffy resubbed for nine months. That's almost a year and a full baby. Grimlock Fly resubbed for seven months and said, what up? How do you do? Grimlock Fly also used 500 bits. Thank you so much. Holy Deviant resubbed for 17 months and said, so happy to finally have time and energy to catch a live one. Well, I'm, I'm honored that you're here. Thank you. Thank you. You guys have your choice of places to be and things to watch, and you came here. Thank you. Like, really. Hewlett Fan 96 resubbed for four months and said, I won't get to see Zangief. So sad. Oh, don't worry. There's plenty of Zangief to go around. I'm sure you'll, you'll definitely hear him. Comfortable Stranger resubbed for 12 months, a full year. One year of only the finest whatever this is. But seriously, thank you for being your awesome self. It is my absolute pleasure. And Neon Light resubbed for six months. Thank you so much. Alrighty, that's right. You, you have a choice, Cherry Cottontail. All right. Let us give it a gander, shall we? Oops, I should probably make it so you can see. Wait, we got it. Okay, great, excellent, perfect. Okay, and how is the music so far? Is that okay? Maybe a little higher. Oh, it's not playing right now. Oh, there it is. How's that? Okay so far? Music balance is good. Excellent. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, excellent. Then we shall move on. So, another thing to keep in mind. This is an early access build. You may encounter bugs or missing features, so never fear. This is not the full game by any means. The full game will be uh, open world, and from what I saw of the map, it looks like it'll probably be pretty large too. Oops, I did not mean to save, so we're gonna go completely empty. All right, so we can choose what we look like. I'm, I liked the original face, but I like this for some reason. And we are gonna go as pasty as possible because I don't go outside. There we go. Hairstyle. I want. Yeah, I like that. I like that one too. I love that. I like, yeah, I think that one's probably the best for me, but there was another one I liked. So there's Pat. <laughs> That's definitely Pat. Uh, hey, how much do you want to bet? that he's gonna choose that, right? How much you wanna bet. So I like that one, but I think I'm, oh, I do like that one too. I think I will go with this one. Red, of course, but they also have other options as well. Uh, I could choose a beard if I wish, right? I, I genuinely like that. You are gonna choose that? I fucking knew it. I knew you would. Oh, and there's Pat's beard, right? Is that the one? Is that the one you're gonna use? I will go with no beard, and as such, I don't get a beard color. Here we go. Talamel is in its twilight. The sands have buried its kingdoms. Corruption unburies its subjects. From such bountiful seeds, this world has reaped only entropy, chaos, and night. And though the secrets of Talamel's ruination are entombed below the Sea of Sand, it's a truth that will not rest. Ooh, spooky.
All right. So, there you have it. That is what little story we have thus far. Uh, so far, I think it's going to drop lore occasionally, much in the way that uh, Dark Souls does. Uh, here we are. We are in the hurdy sand. We are in hurdy sand land. Now, here's what I want to show you. Oops. Hold on. Firstly, these little runes here, these are going to uh, show you, uh, you know, it's going to give you the tutorial. Within the menu, you can equip armor and weapons. <clears throat> Excuse me. You quest in your journal or go to the options menu. So I got ahead of myself. So here is the menu. Uh, to our right, we have our items. Here I have a death stone. Using this item causes you to die, returning to the last place you rested. Use if you are stuck somewhere with no way to get out. At times, giving into the corruption feels like the only way. And over here you have uh, your armor. And here's your sword, which is a rusted remnant sword. Uh, damage is one-handed slashing. Attacks have a 25% chance to generate twice as much corruption. Sword increases corruption generation by 25%. We have our journal, completed quest, title and objective, nothing yet. Now this is why, this is what I wanted to tell you. This is, oh, oh, I'm very big. Oh no, I'm covering the screen. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys, excuse me. I'm just so... I'm so big and excited. <laughs> I'm so sorry here. One second. Kaboom. Here we go. Is that more appropriate? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, you see, I had my hands up really big. And when my hands are up, that means I'm very, I'm very large. Please excuse me. Please excuse me. Um, <laughs> that is so silly. Thank you for catching me, guys. I appreciate you. All right. So this is why... I'm like really uh, like, whoa. This is going to be a huge open world once this full game is out. Massive, massive, massive. Almost as big as me. <laughs> so, uh, let's see, uh, what else? Oops. Let's see, journal. We have our map. We are at the Starspire Refuge, it appears. All right, rock and roll. I'm gonna pop over here. Jumping. Jumping allows you to reach areas that you would not otherwise be able to. Chests and other items may be located off the beaten path, so. By the way, am I a good size now? Is that better? Eh. So you can jump. Nice. So here's something else I should show you. So that swing, so I press, there is a slight delay, so it looks like you have to be a little bit uh, strategic with how you're gonna fight. Let's open this puppet dog. All right, I got a Nitrini equipment note and a haste rune. So this haste rune, when socketed, increases haste by 0.35%. So you, when, the once I get a piece of armor, I'm going to put the rune into the armor, but I don't have any quite yet. Training equipment note, a note written in Lawrence's hand. Uh, Rindell, I hope this note finds you well. Well, not really. If you're reading this, you've come to confiscate my trainee's weaponry once more, a clear overstepping of your authority. But instead of following proper channels of grievance, I've simply hidden his tool of, tools of training in a place you'll never find. Because, as I've so many times made it clear, I believe you to be a fool. Mine in the order, not yours, Lawrence. Ooh, spicy. Okay. Let's see what's going on over here. Of the blue. Ah, so here I can't reach, so I'll have to go around. Looks like there's a guy guarding over there as well. I know, what a rude letter. Let's see. I really, I really like the ambience. The music is really good. Also, uh, they are uh, looking for feedback, so that's really exciting. Because once again, for those of you joining us, this is an early access game. Oh, inspect. The stalagnates appear to move like musculature, 
Each undulating ligament is colored in shades of the sun, at least as it's depicted in the books of old. Leaning closer, you see the formation is covered with dozens of glowing grubs. Ew. I know it does have a fable feel, doesn't it? Ooh, okay, check this out. Dodge or sprint. Giving the button a quick tap will allow you to quickly dodge out of harm's way. Holding down the button will give you a boost in speed by sprinting. So let's see. All right? Nice. Or I can hold it and run. So I imagine I'm gonna be doing a lot, I better get off this bridge. <laughs> uh, I will be doing a lot of like swing and dash. Oops, wait, no, nope, I can do it. Can I do it? Can I manage it? Yeah, eh. So it looks like there's gonna be a lot of dodging and strategic sword play, which as you know, I am very good at. <laughs> well, you may not be the most striking in Star Spire, but you're always reliable with the time. Good to see you, Knight to be. What say we save a town? Our town. Why us? If it isn't the remnant knights who will replenish Star Spire's water stores, then who? You believe this is a task for the town's bellwethers? Recall just a few nights from last, as that fire sang its scorching aria inside Star Spire's church. How many of the town's watchmen stood by our sides to drown its furious spirit? A meager and sober few. But a few did stand with us. I suppose that does mean there's good intentions within the otherwise sniveling ranks. Rude. But goodwill only spread from the top down. Rindell, the lead bellwether, is failing them. Orders what they need, like what we have. But water is a deserved right to each and every soul in Starspire. So let's be the ones to provide it. I'll check my journal and prepare. So it looks like uh, one of the big problems in this town is the lack of water, which I am just running around in. But I think it's the lack of clean water, I think, is the issue. So check this out. Ding! I think I hit my head against it. Isn't that what happened? Hold on. Let me do it again. <laughs> Bung! I'm into that. The Resonance Bell. Ringing the Resonance Bells will heal your wounds, refresh your Testament Bells, and save your progress. Throughout the world, you will find bells and dock bells. If killed, you will revive at the last rung bell. Dark Souls, see? Enemies in the world will also revive, however, also Dark Souls. You will drop your glint or currency on death, and you will have one chance to retrieve it after death. So this does have a nice Souls-like flavor. Hey, what up? Quite the door, isn't it? The Forsaken Gods may have abandoned us when we needed them most, but at least they left some awe-inspiring architecture for us to remember them by. Ah, how I wish we could just break it down. Eesh. Try swinging at it with that fancy sword of yours. Full might. Now, hard as you can. Uh, I jest. <laughs> Don't do that. Oh, you also drop your stuff in Diablo and Torchlight. Ah, oh, very nice, very nice. So what must we do? Well, minus a few arcane hoops in need of jumping, it's quite simple, really. Behind this egomaniacal moor is more water than you've ever likely seen in your life. Myself and the former knights stationed here on Starspire, we've been building a secret reserve. A whole cistern, hidden for when we may need it. But this ancient, forgotten place, it was never meant to be a cistern. The Forsaken Gods enjoyed... attention. Grand temples like this one, made so the kingdoms of man would bow before stone effigies and present offerings, buried underground, away from the light of Lysis. And so, an offering we must give, in that bowl there. 
So in lies the arcane hoops in need of jumping. Night to be. You need find an offering somewhere in this temple and bring it back here. Sounds good. So, first order of business, find some offerings. So let's hop over here. That appears to be an enemy. Normal attacks. Enemies must be dealt with or you may find yourself overrun. Unleash normal attacks to slay them. Normal attacks generate corruption which builds up and can be released as a special attack. No, do not offer Elmo, no. No, offer Pat. All right, so here we go. Ah. So that's a wide ass swing, right? Oh, what, what, oh, thank you. So my problem, as you know, is I tend to want to face fuck everything, ladies. Uh, so I have to be a little careful. And then also, I want to see if I can do this. I don't know. Oh, whoa. Oh yeah, okay. I forgot. That's a special attack, but that doesn't doesn't tell you that until later. Here it is. Oh shit, they're coming. Hold on one second. Eh. It's hard because I have to be more strategic about Ah! Ah! Okay, I got him. Whew. Pick up my monies, thank you. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Ahem. Special attacks. When you've generated enough corruption through normal attacks, unleash a devastating special attack upon your enemies. Using a special attack will also provide you with spell blade charges. It's like Papyrus's special charge, right? Special, special charge, special attack, that. Okay, let's see. Ooh, okay. Is it just swinging, does it? I guess, oh, you have to probably hit. Testament Bells. Testament Bells will close your wounds and recover lost health. They are in limited supply and can be recovered by using the Resonance Bell. So, check it, right? So I'm a little, uh, I've been hurt. A ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Ring my bell, ring my bell. All right, let's see. Oh, oh God. Snaky. Ah! Why did I do that? Got him. Okay. Let's go this way. Do a little jump. Jumpy poo. Eh. Whew. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, crap. Fuck. Oh, fuck. I hate these guys. No, it just feels really good to swing that sword. Ooh, I should probably have been a more a bit more careful. Oh. Fuck. Shit. Oh god. Whew. Okay. That was close. I will ring. A ring a ding ding. Spell blade. When you have a spell gem imbued into your weapon, you may build up spell blade charges through special attacks. While active, you can use block dodge, normal attack, or special attack to activate the different gem that different elemental effects of a spell gem. So let's see what this is. I will use this. Thank you. Artifact discovered. Fire spell blade gem. Let's see. Okay. The fire spell blade gem. The attack. Burning blade extends attack range by. I believe that's 1.5%. Enemies hit will receive burn damage of 2.23 per tick for 10 seconds. Dodge fire wall leaves behind a line of fire that lasts six seconds and deals 5.352 per tick. Wow, okay, that's very concise. Block scorch earth. After a successful block, a burst of flame spreads from you for three meters, dealing 7.805 damage. Select spell gem, then select a weapon to attach it. The spell gem will replace and destroy a previously attached gem. Oh, it will replace and destroy a previously attached gem. Oh, good to know. Well, I would like that. Thank you. Let's see. Excellent. Okay, great. So let's. Hmm. Hold on. Act. Oh, LT. Okay. 
Whoa, okay. <laughs> ah, and there it is. Whoa, it creates a firewall. Did you see that? Okay, that's cool. Okay, all right. Okay, that's pretty good. That's really cool. That's really cool. I did not notice that when I was playing last night. That's super cool. Ah. The numbers are very specific. Can your firewall hurt you? I don't know. That's a good question. Eh. Eh. Gotcha. So good. Gotcha, bitch. Okay, what's this? Pick up armor. Yo, wrapped pants. Give me those pants. Health. Uh, wrapped pants. Dodgy. To uh, set bonus, after dodging, you take 25% less damage for two seconds. Love it. After dodging, you take 50% less. Oh, okay. All right, let's... So now let's put a haste rune. Wait. If I put the haste rune on, does it break if you put another one on? No. Let's see what happens. Give me fast pants. Yeah, fast pants. Fast pants. Give me those fast pants. Oh, fast. Oh, uh, if you are interested in getting the game, uh, please feel free to use my code at free.tm slash peach. It's in the title or it's on Steam. It is, it's genuinely pretty neat. All right, oh, I want, did I go that way? No, I did not, okay. Ah. Like, I can't believe this game has taught me, ah! To be a bit more wary. Oh, god damn it. Oh no. Oh, I almost died. Whew. To be a bit more wary of uh, attacks than Dark Souls. <laughs> I think that's pretty interesting. Let's see. Huh? Ooh, backpack. If it weren't for the time-worn straps that make this bag so recognizable, it would be the mixed aromas that emanate from within. Galena's medicine bag. Also, sorry if I'm, like, speaking kind of weird today. Oops. Oh, gosh. Oh, my mouth is, like, so dry. I didn't drink as much water today. Oh, gosh! Stop it! Ah! Ew, okay. Ah! God. Ah! Mm. Oh God, I have no more bells. No more bells! No! Surely there's a bell. Is there a bell? Are there any bells? No! Oh, oh crap. Oh no. Oh, oh dear. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Poor choices. <laughs> Poor choices, no! Eh. No, scary. Oops, dang it, ah! Hold on, I gotta get over here. So I have a chance, there we go. Okay, okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. Woo, woo, woo! Crap. I did it! I can't believe I managed that, okay. Ah, oh, that was scary, okay. Ah! I see that I will have to wait. All right, so I'm probably toast here in a minute. I know I have my special attacks. I need to use those. But like Papyrus, I am conservative with my special attacks. I did it. I know, right? Like DS2 all over again. All right, let's see what this is. Blocker pair. Okay, this, this is new to me. Blocker parry, you will take reduced damage while holding block. Okay. Um, time your block just right to avoid taking damage and momentarily stun the enemy. This allows you to deal increased damage to them. Wait, no, that's... Wait. Okay. Well, let's see. Int okay. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm gonna have a hard time with this. Crap. Ah, oh, I died. No. I did it wrong. Ah. 
I'm not good at parrying. No. Well, that's okay. All right, I'm back. That's fine. That's fine. We didn't get far. Okay. We can get there. We can get there. I've learned my lesson, maybe. No promises. Crap. Oh my god. Here, let's see, since I'm close to the bell, if I can practice this. Wait, why did I let him do that? Hold on. Let's see. Okay, I want to see something. Oh, honestly! <laughs> ah! So, parry and lunge. Parry and lunge. Okay, I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I've always been so bad about parrying anything ever. Okay. Oh! It's the, that second attack that gets me. Let's try it again. Got him. Yeah! Okay. 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 Now let me go, eh, I'll keep going. I got my bells. I got three bells, what you got? Nothing. Uh. Crap, crap. Yeah, take that, yeah. What? Ah! <laughs> I got too excited. Oh, God. Do I have a roll? No, uh, at least not that I know of yet, but I do have a dash. And I can run quickly if I hold down the dash. Let's try this again. Oh, golly. Oof. Okay. Take the money. All right. Now I can use the fire. There we go. Let's try it again. Oh, it's still hurting him. Oh, that's rad. Cool. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Good to know. Okay. So, which way? It's over in the green area, right? Oh. Ah! Oh. Ah! Gotcha, 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 gotcha. This area. Oh, oh, what's this? I didn't notice that last time. Scripture of Lysis. A priest may find use for this scripture. Okay, good to know, good to know, good to know. I didn't notice that last time. Oh, oh gosh. Wait, where did that other one go? Ah, there you are. guys up here, right? Nope. Oh, nope. Oh. 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 Oh, I didn't go up here last time. Okay, here we go. Ah, dear knight to be. Your presence warms my soul, but not a creaking thing for my fingers. <sighs> Frigid, wretched place, this temple. Even with the Church of Lisa still in embers, right above the very spot where we stand. A horrible thing, that, the fire. Yes, it was and terrible. that fire, it's left us with all this. An entire river of runoff. Ashen, sickened runoff. My, we threw all the water we had at that fire, didn't we? Uh, well, at least we're still alive. What are you doing down here, Galena? I'm Galina? still holding out hope that I can salvage something from the church above in this runoff. We lost a lot of memories in that blaze, and a friend, too. Even if he did what he... Uh, well, anyway, there's a chest that's caught in the debris at the mouth of this runoff. Maybe worth your while. Can we drink from this water? We can't, no. Ash and debris aside, this water carries the corruption of the Night Plague. 
one drink, you might start to have shadowed thoughts. A full belly of it. You will not be you anymore. We can't let a soul in stars buy a drink from this. <laughs> I want to ask, like, will I be a better version of me? Like, cooler? Stay safe, Galena. Goodbye. Okay. So I can walk in it, but you cannot drink this. Or you will go crazy. Aha. Uh -huh. Boop. Give me chest. Sacramite dust. Let's see what that is. Fine grains of a precious ore. Ooh, okay. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so I think I've explored that area. Eh. Ooh, gotcha. Ah! Gotcha. Wah. Oh, money. Okay, I don't know if I went this away, this away. Oh, God. Eh, oh, I'm still trying to figure out the, the length of the sword. There we go. Excellent. Is there a jump? Yes. Yes, there is. Okay, I went that way. I've been that way. I think I went this away. Oh, yeah, that's where Galena is. Okay. All right, I think I need to continue going this way, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. So there's Galena's backpack. There's a snaky poo. Ah! Ah! Okay, that's right, yeah. Better take care of this guy. There we go. Okay, excellent. So I'm gonna ring my little tinkery bell. Little tinkery bell. What's up, guys? No. What? What? Oh, get out. I did not know that was there. I did not know. Is that? Get out. Get out. I did not. Just, just is that seriously a discovery? Get out. What? Get out. Okay, I swear. I swear to God, I did not know that that was there. What? Is there anything of value in here? Can I... Am I supposed to be in here? I don't know. I don't know. What the hell? What? Ah. Uh. Oh. Oh. Maybe. Oh. Oh. What? Oh. Oh. No! Let me in! Let me in! Crap! What? That li oh, come on. What in the world? Bummer. Oh, there must be something I'm missing here. Oh, it's so dark. What in the hell? Ah. Uh hmm. Oh. Okay, and this is the ledge. Oh, bummer. Oh, well, can I... Well, let's find out, I guess. Well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is early access. I imagine that'll be something later. Ah, I imagine that'll be something later. That's fine. Yeah, this game's an early access. But that did surprise me. Cool, okay, okay. I'm getting the hang of this. Let's go, fellas. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah! 
Oh, that's good. Okay, I like that. Ooh, a crit critical rune. Increases crit damage by 4.5. I have nowhere to put you yet. Let's see. I should. Oh, I should give the scripture to what's his face, maybe. Ooh, Mr. Lawrence. Oh, hello. Ugh, they're like just slow enough, but also just fast enough that I can't. Oh, what's this? A health rune. When socketed, increases health by 4.6. Let's see, what do you have? Rune, armor. Armor penetration rune, hey. What do we have? Wrapped gloves. Okay. Armor penetration rune. When socketed, increases armor penetration by 0.6. And critical rune. I think I'm gonna go for that. We're gonna put it in my gloves. Kablam. Let's try that. Ooh. Spell gem. Frost. Hell yeah. Thank y'all. So. Frost spell blade gem. Frost burn is the attack slow enemies hit for two seconds and apply debuff, causing them to deal 7% less damage. Did I say debuff? I meant debuff. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, Dodge's chill step leaves behind a wall of ice that lasts for 2.89 seconds and block and case cannot be staggered or stunned while blocking. Okay. So a lot of the enemies appear to be... Oh no! Oh, that's for armor, isn't it? Boo. Wait, no, that's this. There we go. That goes in the sword. I'm going to get rid of the... I'm going to destroy the fire one. We'll try this out. Because a lot of the enemies appear to be fire-based. I have no idea if they are. They just appear to be with their lava tongues and whatnot. Let's take a look in this cabin. Ooh. What's that? Oh, shit. Goddamn snake. Ah! Oh, get out of here. Armor rune. What else is... What is that? What? Oh. Armor rune when socketed. Increases armor by 2.3. Hey. Okay. Good to have. Good to have. All right. So I went this way. I've gone the, the green way. Let's see. Is there anything else over here that I'm missing? Did I? I think I... Yeah, that's the testament bells. Okay, I just want to be sure I'm not missing anything. It's in the water. Okay, cool. I'm gonna use this frosty shit. That'll probably help me. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Here we go. Go you! Alright, you spooky bastards. Let's go. Eh. It's too bad you can't get them to hit each other. Oh, ah! There we go. Ah! Ah! There we go. Okay. Gotta build up my ice attack. Okay, and there's that guy down there. Don't have to. Oh, oh yeah, you. Ah. Oh yeah. Much better. Much better. Thank you. Armor rune. What do we have? Oh, I got two of them. Nice. I'll take it. Oh, he's still frozen. I will take it. Okay. I'm gonna go back up here to talk to Galena. Or actually, no. I will go this away instead. There we go. That's better. Uh, ah! No, the bells! Ah! Ring! Ring your bell! Whew, there we go, okay. Shoof. Stinky gas, get out of here. There we go, that's better. Give me your money, snakes! Alright. So yeah, when, I've noticed when I dot, or sorry, when I, um, do my dash. Looks like I've got little shields. I like that. Hello. 
do we have? Ah, hey! Oh, it was a trap. Hey, hey, get out of here. Whoa. Oh, oh my god. phone call okay pick up the master cast pummel master ca oh oh i'll pick it up thank you let's see pummel master cast janky janky attacks deal from negative 50 to plus 75 damage wow oh oh that's for crafting used to learn to craft weapons with this pommel Interesting, interesting. Blah! Okay, there we go. Okay. Let's see. It's guarding some stuff over here. In the icy, not icy, the bluer portion. I need an offering. Oh, okay, good. Oh, I can skip those guys. Nice. Okay. Hello, shiny thing. The stones beneath your feet have been delicately carved by hand. This pattern is found all across the temple, but here encased within the circle, it gives the sense of waves in an ocean. It does. At least how you would imagine waves to be. Oh yeah, I don't see much water. Okay. Let's go, boys. I don't have enough. Ah! Shoot. Oh, no. Oh, goodness. What the hell is that? Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, this is... Oh. Oh, golly. Ooh. What? Is he helping me? What's happening? Ah! What? Oh, it's just fighting everything. Okay. Oh, uh, if you want to use my link, uh, just just go to uh, free.tm slash peach. It will take you to the Steam page for uh, Sands of Aura. So you can uh, check out the... Oh, wait, hold on. So you can check out the trailer, see what it's about, you know, see what you think. What did I get? Did I get Hastrin? Okay, okay. All right. So I screwed up. Let me try again. Hold on. Actually, let me... Let me, let me talk to Lawrence here. Maybe he can... You are a gem, I'll admit. But this forsaken god will not consider you an offering. Take nothing personal. Aww, the I am a gem. The forsaken gods were asses of a celestial degree. I like you, Lawrence. Always, can I ask you a question? Lord, ever always. It smells of smoke. Mm -hmm. The church fire was just above this temple. Much of it has collapsed down here. A great sadness. The only god that didn't abandon us, and her church is gone. Stay focused on the water. No sense weeping over burnt cinder. Hmm. What will qualify as an offering? The forsaken gods were quite infatuated with arcane trinkets. There will be something down here that will qualify. Check the various shrines scattered through the temple. If they don't have offerings, they'll definitely have something you can use. Oh, hold on. Let me... Can I post this? Let's see. There you go. That's my link. Feel free to check that out. Uh, also, yeah. That is... Uh, another thing that I wanted to bring up. At some point, I'm going to be... Uh, I don't know if I'll have a whole stream just to, like, whatever. Um... But I am going to make more mods because I, I only have so many. And I think I should have more. Uh, who were the Forsaken Gods? They were the ones who made this world beautiful and bountiful. <sighs> then no, 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 took no. it away and abandoned us with the dust in their wake. They were a supreme unkindness night to be. This temple was built in the name of the god Melgum. He's believed to shape Talamel like it were a ball of clay in his hands. In essence, he's the bastard who made the mountains and the valleys. Thank you, Lawrence. Okay. Oh, look how 
big and strong I am. Cool. Come on. That was... That was BS. Okay. Not too bad. I just want to get to where I was. Let's see. And as you guys know, I am notorious for poor direction. Can you help me get back there? Ah. I think I remember. Oh, get out of here, snake. 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 All right. I... There. And I think... No, I went... Yeah. Oh, went this way. Right. Go Starbird! Hey, I'm not Wooly. Come on. Let's see. I think it's... Yeah, this way. Okay, there we go. There we go. Eh. Go. Ah! Alright, I'm just gonna run from these guys. They are rude. Go. I think. Oh, no. No. Is it this way? Oh, golly. Yeah, it's this way. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, Weast. Are you still following me? Oh, for real? Oh, Lord. Ah! Gotcha. Awful. Okay. So I will go here. Bail. Dang it. Oh. Uh, uh. Nice try. Nice try. Too fast. Too fast. Suck it. Okay. This a Y. This a Y. Yes. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Larbird. Who says Larbird? Is that. That's not real. No. Okay, I'm gonna grab a little money. I think I'm gonna try to stay away from those guys and attempt to fight whatever the hell that weird thing was that attacked all of us. Oh, oh God, oh, it's horrible, oh. Oh God, oh, that's, oh my, you gotta be shitting my balls, dude. Oh, come on! Ah, okay, all right. From now on, I will avoid that horrible thing instead of uh, trying to utilize it. Okay, all right, all right. Okay, I got this now, I got this, I got this. Ah. Gotcha. Okay, I'm getting it, I'm getting it. Oh, we scratched each other. Okay, so they can hurt, hurt each other. That's interesting. Ah. Oh, the stairs. Boo! Okay, so height matters. Okay. There we go. Okay, great, 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 great. Ooh, I don't want to miss my money. Toot. I am big and strong, Kurt. No, please listen. Okay, okay, okay. And then I go this away, past the annoying snake. There we go. Past the snake. Jump over the thingy. Eh. Ah! No! Oh no! Get out of here! Ugh! Rude! And I'll fight you, and then I will ring my bell. Shit! Ah! Gotcha! 
Ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Okay, and then we go up and to the left. Hello, Galena. What up, girl? Oh, God. Fight this a-hole. Oh, these a-holes. Excuse me. Oh, it's so annoying. Oh, I got a parry. Gotcha. Oh, you gotta be shitting. Oh my god. Okay, I got him, I got him. Oh, the snakes. I hate you guys. Uh, come back here. Oh my god. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, they won't come. Oh, that's funny. They won't come up. Critical rune, health rune, nice, love it. Speaking of health, I should probably ring the bell, but I'll wait just a little bit. Okay, first order of business. Do not go near the horrible weird thing that attacked us. That's not good. Steer clear of that area. Shit, ah, gosh. Whew, I did it. Okay. Okay. Aha. Oh, God. Ahaha. Yes. Excellent. Offering to Melsum. Okay, excellent. Ooh, shiny thing. Melgum's Temple of the All Right. <laughs> They're all right. Cute. Temple of the Deep Well. Interesting. Milgram's Temple of the Pure Seed. Oh, God. <laughs> Temple of the Kind Shade. And oh, this one's broken. Oh, Temple of the Fellow Star. Did I read this one? Of the Sanctum Set. Pure Seed, nothing but. Temple of the Free Spirit. Life Prism. I think this is the first one. And the All Right. Okay, interesting. Okay. All right, I'm steering the fuck clear of that shit because that guy beat my ass and I don't want to get my ass kicked. So I will go this way first. Far below you, bridges extend across the endless abyss. These were believed to be the aqueducts that transferred the water supply to the great kingdoms across Talamel. Interesting. Ooh, rickety, rickety. Hello. I would like whatever that is, please, and thank you. Oh, a scripture. Thank you. Um, oh, what's over there? Oh, I want to know what's over here, though. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, I goofed it. Shit. Yeah, nice! Okay. Did my work for me. Thank you very much. Eh. Excellent. Oh, okay. I see. I see. And now we're back up to the backpack. Got it. Got it. Got it. Excellent. Wait a minute. Was that there before? I didn't see that before. Oh, interesting. Huh. Well. You know what? I will ring my bell. Gotcha! Yeah! Yeah! In your face! In your face! What do you... What is this? Armor of face wrap. Nice. There's the offering. If you're dodging, you take 25% less damage for two seconds. I would love that. Thank you. What do I want to put? Um, there's another haste. A spell... No, that's for the blade. Um, I think I could use a health item, maybe. Yeah. Let's put it in my head. Clonk. Nice. Okay. Ooh, wow. Let's just double check over here a few things. The people of Starspire once interred their dead here amongst those that have been dead for a millennium, warmed by Melgum's embrace. It's oh. not very warm here, though. 
Not at all. Not at all. Oh, golly. Oh, okay. That looks like a big bad's down there, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna see what this is, though. Uh. Oh, lightning! Ooh. Love it. Chain lightning. Deal 21.185 damage and jump targets four times when you attack. Wow. Uh, dodge is ball lightning. Allows players to teleport through enemies and deal 18.64 damage to all enemies along the path. Okay, wow. Block is Taze. Immobilize enemies that hit you for five seconds and cause them to take 22% more damage. Effect is removed when they take damage. Uh, yeah. Yeah, love it. See you later, Frost. I'm into that. All right, let's give that a try. Is this a door as well? No, that's... Oh, okay. It requires a key. Okay. Um, first I'm just gonna take a peek a rooney over here. Interesting. Ahoy there. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, this is okay, so right there's the beginning. Okay, interesting. Health rune, sacramite dust. Thank you. Thank you for dust. All right, let's open that big scary gate. I'm sure nothing bad's behind that. Uh. <laughs> okay. Well, that's ominous. Oh, that's a oh, I have the head wrap on. Okay, I was like, oh, I did. I'm a I have a blonde ponytail. <laughs> oh, golly. Perfect. We're back. I'll go ahead and ring the bell. Ding. Ahoy there. You are a gem, I'll admit. But this uh. forsaken god will not consider you. No, an I offering. have the offering though. <laughs> so your test Oh, I didn't show you the journal. So here's the journal. Sorry, oopsie daisy. Uh, real quick, so here's the journal. The reserve supply. My mentoring knight, Lawrence, has a large reservoir of fresh water that our town of Starspire desperately needs. It's stored in the broken remnants of a temple dedicated to the Forsaken. I think they mean Forsaken God Melgum. Uh, remember, this is early access. To enter his inner sanctum where the water is stored, we must appease the old god's wants by means of an offering. There should be a suitable vestige somewhere in the racked temple. Well, guess what, bitch? I got it for well you. Well done, knight to be. Well done. The water, it's just through here. Uh, come, this way. Onward. Well, all right, here we go. Oh. Behold, the reason Starspire will never dry up. This cistern is no, 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 Lisa, uh, no. Oh my God! What the? F what is that? That's horrible. Mm. Corrupt corpses there in the water, fallen from the church fire. If we act quickly, most of the reserve can be saved. Oop, work quickly. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Corrupt corpses. There. Okay. Uh, we got, we gotta get rid of the corrupt corpses. Let's see. Oh. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Ugh. Beast from the waters. To arms! There we go. Ah! Woo! Okay! Oh 
my god. Wow. Oh boy. Ah! Okay, I can do it, I can do it. Whew. Oof. Yo, Lawrence, what up, dude? You just straight chillin'? What's happening over here? Crap. Ah! Oh god. Yeesh. Crap, 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 crap. Oof, okay. Ah! Shoot. Oof. Shit. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, I was I was holding on to my butt there. Woohoo! Okay. <laughs> hey y'all, what up? Lawrence, what's happened? Ear splitting that screeching. Are you bleeding? Up, up. We've got to get you out of here. Lawrence has been wounded. Whatever that creature was, it was the sickened water that made it. <laughs> we must drain the reservoir. All of the water. Drain it all. Night to be. I'll take care of it, Lawrence. Damn, that sucks. Okay, so is there anything else I need to do here? No, okay. Looks like I'm gonna drain the water. That sucks. As you work the ramshackle mm. device, a heaving sigh is heard deeper in the <sighs> chamber. Num, 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 num. The sound of rushing water causes saliva to swell in your cheeks. Peach saliva! But this water is not for you. Oh. It is for no soul here. I appreciate that you can skip all these if you really want to. Whoa. Oh, that's bad. That was all fresh water. Ugh. That sucks. Whew. Imagine being the guy who has to press that button. Huh, wouldn't want it to be me. Let's go. Loading. Okay, where is everybody? I'm gonna ring my little, my dingy dong. Wait, where is everybody though? Hey, what? I guess I should probably go this way. Where did y'all go? Don't leave me here in the spooky cave. Who knows what shenanigans I'll get up to. Come on. Oh, there we are. Time to go. Leave cavern. New Londo Water Park, nice. Ooh, okay. Oh, wow. The hell? Oh, it's so quiet. Grunt. Night to be. <sighs> go to Lawrence. he would be back home. Your home. Oh, excuse me. I will go the other way then. Love the voice acting in this. I actually don't know who the... I saw someone asking who the um, Lawrence was. I don't know who that is, but he sounds so familiar to me as well. Oh, 
up we go, up we go. Oh, people, hello everybody. Wow, okay, hello. Oh, bellwether. Mm, excuse me, Slately the bellwether. He's the eyes, I'm the ears, but I can see good too. Double Fred I am. This is obvious you're skilled. Thin the bellwether. Use best all, keep yourselves in order. We know this here's odd times, but we're reporting everything we see and hear back to the man himself. Take it easy. Hey guys. Listen closely. There might be more corrupt beasties lurking about. The beasties. best way to deal with a creature tainted by the night plague is to face it square on. Look them right in their undead eyes. Show them you're not afraid of anything. Perhaps it's best if you both stick near me until we've got all this under control. Oh god, one of these. Listen closely. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Walk away. Hello. As core champions of the Starspire Post Haste Plague Prevention League, we thought it best if we made our presence known after this incident with the water reserves. Post Haste Plague Prevention League? We must prevent plague of gripes. Aye. For prevention's sake, we blocked the path into town until we're sure nobody wet their beaks from the tainted cistern. Prevention, see? That's what we do. Prevention, I see. Right, I. We'll get this path reopened as soon as we know where our water stands. Or floats, rather. Sounds like a plan. Aye. And when our boys come and help us lift these heavy bastards. Aye. Aye, goodbye, fellows. Hello, cool-looking person. Oh, eh. Kauzum, the reformed seether. So the Knight of Starspire was wounded in a fight against a great beast of corruption. The information should not leave this island. Tell not a soul. There are people out there who would see this as an advantageous time to strike against Starspire. Ooh, who are you? You are awesome. Heed my words. I will heed them. So that's my home. Let me just double check. Let me just take a gander. Oh, who's that? Hello. Eh, I want to talk to you real quick. What's up? You'll have to go around. Some bellwether lost his set of keys, and Rindell's shut down the thoroughway till it's found and returned. Take the long way around. A little exercise will do you good. That is true. All right. So before I pop inside, I'm going to take a quick pee break. Ooh, there we go. So I'll be right back. It'll be like we had two minutes tops. And oh, if, oh, there we go. I'll be right back. Wah, 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 wah. There we go. I had the mic off. Wah, wah. Can you see and or hear me? Wah. Wah, wah. Excellent. Okay. 
Oh, good, okay. I thought I couldn't hear this just for a moment, but now I can hear it. Okay, great. Oh, wow. Huh, okay. Cool. So this is looking, oh, it's looking bleak as fuck. You see all that sand? It's not good. It's coarse and rough. It gets everywhere. Let's go to my house. Uh-oh. Lawrence, I have no blessings to offer without the book of scripture, but sometimes the words themselves can be healing. Lysus is loved in this home, but your fancy words won't do much here, priestess. You may go. Ouch. Neve, the Lysistral priestess. The young Lysistral priestess fumbles her knuckles, her wrists, menial motions driven by nerves. She doesn't belong here, but she wants to. Her chin points deeper into her chest as you approach. Greet the priestess. Young knight, I mean not to disturb. Oh. Galena, be kinder to the new priestess. She's trying to be useful. Uh, become a part of us. And stop fussing. Uh, there's nothing the matter with me. I got my big jug of water. How hard did I pee? So hard. Porcelain shattered. <laughs> Uh, enter. There you are, night to be. When this water crisis is solved, I'm marching you right in front of the remnant order to face judgment. What? Because after what you've done today, oh. <laughs> that was well knightly. You darn tootin'. <laughs> A thing of fate. Yeah, this guy well is dead. worked. But alas, Star Spire's still without water. Which means we must bargain with Tupi, the sage Tupi. of Talamel. Tupi! Or rather, you will have to bargain. Tupi, Tupi. To Where must I go? you'll find the grotto, home of the sage Tupi. Tupi! Uh, Tupi's grotto sits on the only clean aquifer in all of Talamel. Speak with him. Ooh, excuse me. Strike a deal, if you can. He's the only hope Star Spire has for water. <clears throat> You'll travel by Grainwake, and Felka, the June faring knight, will travel with you via Grainwake. He's already waiting at the docks. Grainwake, that is such a fucking cool name. As you should. All right. Ask them, and I'll answer. What is a Grainwake? I don't fully know. My best guess is that it once was a small, thirsty thing. Something that never meant any harm. But mm -hmm. when it found our tainted water reserves, oh. drank as instinct told it to, and never stopped until it was what it had become. In a it way, it saved us. Had oh. I not seen ah. the full extent of the water's <laughs> corruption, Lawrence! Lawrence! had twisted that creature. Many people Lawrence, in Star Spire may look just like it now. Lawrence. Okay, so I think what happened there, I asked about the grain wakes, but I think it thinks I asked what the what was the corrupted beast. Remember, early access. So uh, the question I asked is, was, do you mean why are sandboats called grain wakes? Star Spire may not be a massive settlement, and truth be told, we don't have much to offer, but Egan and his crew make the best sand ships in all of Telamel. Light as a piece of grain, nimble eye, grain wake. Okay. So I think I think what happened was it the I think it just got confused. Am I a remnant knight now? If it were up to me, only me, I'd have my sword on your shoulder at this very moment. But there are remnant knights more senior than myself. Honorable men and women they, and it's only by their approval that you can be bestowed. But after the waters are restored to Star Spire, they'll know of what you've done. From my lips, they'll hear it. Ugh. And then we'll be brothers in this honored bond. Aw. So we heard what the corrupted beast was. Will you be? Oh, who is Tupi? He's an ancient one. Has a deep connection to Talamel. It's best you meet him to understand him. But no matter the impression he makes, know that he serves only one. This dying world. That does not, Knight to be, include the humans that inhabit it. Keep mind of his intentions. 
Will you be all right? Oh, Lysis, now you too. Cute. I'll be fine. Fine, that's all for now. Before you head off, your gear might need some attention. Take this glint and sacramite over to the forge on Starspire's lower terrace and give your gear a look over. Wouldn't want to leave Starspire unprepared for the dangers of this world. No, ma'am. Thank you. Can I talk to only you, though? No. And you're done? I hope all you've come bearing is questioned. Nope, see ya. I'm good. Okay. Let's see. The head of a massive tortoise, Ooh. and beside it are two spitterworm heads. Oh. Lawrence spoke of fantastic stories of how he survived encounters with all sorts of different beasts and monsters. The tortoise lives in lava fields and fends off predators by throwing heated stones at them. Ooh. Spitterworms, on the other hand, are very aggressive and assail those who come too close with corrosive spit. Sounds like my brother. All right. What do we got? Oh, hey, what's up? Is that my room, I assume? No. Anything I can... Eh. Let's see. Can I cut things? Arr, no. Shoot. Okay, interesting. Oh, a chest. Okay, great. What you got for me, baby? Runes, runes, thank you for runes. Many runes. Wait, I just wanna make sure. Okay, there's the, 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 the. And, did I go in here? I did not. Golly. Anything I can read or break or steal. 